Hello fellow Toastmasters and friends! In this video, I will show you how we can make use of the speech timer for Toastmasters website and connect it to Zoom so that we can use this whenever we take the timer role. So as you can see, it's actually complete with time for table topics, evaluation, icebreaker, and speech. It's also very easy to use. Table topics, the green light will appear at 1 minute, yellow light 1 minute and 30 seconds, red light for 2 minutes and disqualification or the blinking red for 2 minutes and 30 seconds. You can also have the option to show the clock or not. But usually for me, I show the clock. If the time required is not here, you can just modify it and put on the figures depending on the required time. And when you're ready, just click on start, the time will begin. Okay, so... Whenever the speaker stops, that's where you click on stop as well. And then just click on reset to go back to this view. Okay, now, how can we connect this to Zoom? We need two applications. Okay, we need the first one, OBS Studio. Download it at obsproject.com and click on the operating system that you are using on your laptop or computer. After downloading it, you also have to download OBS Virtual Cam. Okay, make sure it's the latest version. OBS Virtual Cam 2.0.5 and go to download if you want to download it. And of course, we need to download it so we can use the timer for Toastmasters in our Zoom meeting. Okay, once we are done with that, we can go to OBS and Zoom to fix some settings. Don't worry, I will also put the, the URL for OBS and the virtual cam on the description, video description. Now let's go to OBS. It would look something like this. I'm currently recording this video right now. Anyway, just go to tools and go to virtual cam and make sure that auto start is selected for the virtual cam. Now, we just have to create a scene. Okay. Just name it Timer TMC, Timer for Toastmasters Club, and then add the source, which is the browser. There, our URL, where we put the URL for this website, timer.calibgrove.com. You just have to copy this one and then paste it here. There you go, and then you just have to also set the dimensions the width and the height for it to occupy our screen perfectly then let's press ok and now there you go so this will serve as the virtual camera and this will be visible in your zoom meeting okay, so we have to adjust it so that this will be the only one that will be visible of course for you to be able to interact with it just like a normal website you just right click on it and click on interact and you can normally control it just like how you control the website so now let's go to zoom just a quick setting that we have to do let's go to the video settings click on advanced and make sure direct 3d 11 for video rendering method and that is it that is it once you're ready you just click on OBS camera and click on start video here here you go as you can see the timer is connected have it is how you connect speech timer for Toastmasters website to your zoom as a timer and whenever you attend virtual meetings OBS has to be open and sometimes or most of the time you have to shift from OBS to zoom and in my case I even have PowerPoint open wherein I encode time for each speaker it would look something like this whenever I take the timer roll so as you can see two windows open and on my taskbar I also have PowerPoint below I hope I was able to help you if you want to do your timer roll using OBS and if you have other suggestions on how we can improve being the timer during virtual meetings please do let me know on the comment section below if you are new to Toastmasters or if you want to know more about Toastmasters you may want to subscribe to our channel as well Synergy Toastmasters Club thanks for watching and hope to see you in Toastmasters where leaders are made God bless